Cinema 5D at Photokina 2016 is brought to you by Angel Bird, there to capture your creative moments. Tilta, arm your camera. Genus Tech, redefining the price point for quality camera accessories. Blackmagic Design, creating amazing solutions for film, post-production and television. And Manfrotto, imagine more. Hi, I'm Adam with Cinema 5D. We're here at Photokina 2016 at Goal Zero. So with Lisa here, and we're going to be talking about the Yeti 1400 lithium battery. Uh, so please um, tell us a little bit more about this battery solution. Yeah, so the uh, the Yeti lithiums are a really exciting line that are pretty unchallenged in the market. They're a really great source for reliable, renewable power no matter where you go, running anything from lights to cameras, laptops, so on and so forth. Like you mentioned, it's 1,400, so 1,400 watt hours, which is the capacity. And then you've got multiple different outputs here, depending on what you're looking to do. 220 volt universal inverter, you have high speed USB ports at the bottom, as well as 12 volt ports over here. Okay, so let's say if we were looking to run uh, like a 300 watt light out of this, it would probably run for what, four and a half hours maybe? Yeah, just about four and a half or five hours. The great thing about these Yeti lithiums is that they have this intelligent display that will actually show you how much power you're pulling out and give you kind of a, a fuel gauge in a sense of how long they will run until they are empty. And then if you're charging it, say with a solar panel at the same time, you can see input and output and almost balance out your load completely. Lovely. And talking of charging, you have a, a number of charging options for this unit. Uh, you have uh, solar charging and also you can charge it via mains power as well. Um, how long does it roughly take to charge with those options? So with the solar option, it's completely dependent on how much power you put into it. If you max out the inputs, you're about a day's worth of sun. But like I said, you can monitor your inputs and outputs at the same time. These batteries allow for something called pass-through power, which means you can be charging it and using it all at the same time, which is a great solution for solar. If you plug it into a main unit, into an AC, you're looking at about eight to 10 hours to charge it up completely. So it's, it's meant to do it overnight. Okay, and we also talked a little bit earlier about the potential for like a, a fast charging dock. Uh, can you tell us a little bit more about that? Yeah, so the modularity for these units is really exciting for us. It's something different that we're exploring that nobody else really has in the realm of portable power. Underneath the lid here, you can see some different inputs, but the one that we're really excited about is this carriage that's removable. We're working with a couple drone companies to see what a quick charge solution for that might be. And it really opens up the possibilities of working with new partners, especially in a photo specific industry where we can really deliver power for a consumer's needs. Nice. Um, what about the pricing and availability of the Yeti? Yeah, so the Yeti 1400 lithium is going to be available in early spring is what we're looking toward. It's going to retail for about 2.5 euro. So it has a good price tag on it, but it's a lot of power packed in a very small part. It is indeed. Lisa, thank you very much for that. And thank you very much for watching. Thank you.